Hey everybody, Miles J here, and welcome to another Q&A with Miles J, number eight. And before I get started on answering your questions, I just want to answer some frequently asked questions that I see around YouTube a lot. These are what my extensions look like. They have little silver clips on them, so that way you can snap them into your hair and whatnot. It smells really good. And if you have enough facial hair, you can go ahead and snap it on your face and give yourself a nice pink mustache. And bitches gonna hate, because they gonna see your mustache flowing in the wind. That's right. Hate bitches, hate on my pink mustache. And a lot of you have been asking where I get my contacts from. I get my contacts from PinkyParadise.com. It's a contact website based in Korea, and they have all kinds of different lenses, mostly for cosplay, but some of them you can wear on a day-to-day -day basis. These contacts are Max Pure Green. I have two other contacts. One's Max Pure Blue, and another one is like Barbie Blue or something like that. They're all circle lenses. Circle lenses have black rings around them that make your eyes appear bigger. And that's how you can differentiate between a normal contact and a circle lens. And eight hours later, sorry about the sudden light change, but my camera suddenly decided to turn off. Okay, so I'm trying to make my Q&As nice and spiffy, so I'm going to answer three questions from Twitter, three questions from Facebook, three questions from YouTube, and three questions from Tumblr, and I'll have like 12 questions, right? Did I do my math right? I hope I did. Good God, I need to go back to school. We're going to start with Twitter. Victor James asks, do you like America's Next Top Model? If so, what's your favorite cycle and winner? I love America's Next Top Model. But the thing is, I really don't care for the cycles or the seasons. I would rather be in it myself because whenever I would watch it, I would just be like, what are these basic bitches doing? America's Next Top Model hit me up. Abby Dawson asks, are you going to VidCon 2012? VidCon is in LA, right? It's in LA. If it's in LA, then I'm probably going to go because LA is not that far from where I live. I should be able to go, but plus I'm going to need like a hotel and stuff. Oh my God. But yeah. Um. Oh, there goes my hat. Dennis asks, how can you have fun with a plastic bag? Okay, so for this fun trick, you're going to need a really large plastic garbage bag. Place the garbage bag over your head. Conceal all air from the bag, like so. Now proceed to sing Katy Perry's Firework. Do you ever feel like a plastic bag? But seriously, kids, don't ever play with plastic bags. You're going to suffocate yourself and die. Moving on to Tumblr. Ragtime Mouth asks, where do you get your extensions from, and how many does it take to achieve that look? I get my extensions at Sally's Beauty Supply. I don't know if they have that on the East Coast. My brand of extensions is called Euronext, and I got them in 18 inches, so that way they last nice and long. And it's that good. Good Remy human hair girl. X X X X X Y am I not a Mashi X X X X X asks Good God, these Tumblr names. If you woke up one day from a coma and were told that there was no such thing as the internet and it was all in your dream, what would your reaction be? And how would you live your life after that? I don't think he's gonna make it out of this one. <gasps> Never mind. Do you guys get internet here? I'm sorry, but the internet doesn't no! exist. Wait, <gasps> Miles, where are you going? That's how that would go. Custo Dash Barcelona asks, how do you get your teeth so white? I don't know. I really think it's the exposure in my camera that's really making my teeth so bright and white. And um, I think it's an optical illusion. Not everything that you see on the camera is... Yeah. Moving on to Facebook, Julia asks, do you ever plan on directing or acting for TV? Directing may come a little bit later in life, but acting is a definite like, I'm going to do that. Alex asks, how do you remove a yeast infection? Oh wait, no, they were just kidding. If you could go back in time and change something, what would it be? I would change the fact that I was so romantically desperate. Yeah, I would change that. Billy asks, what is your favorite thing to do and how do you go about doing it? Okay, so my favorite thing to do is eat and how I go about doing it is I get some food like this Pop-Tart right here and then I raise it up to my mouth and I open my mouth and buy it. Oh my God. Oh, it's so crummy. Uh, but it tastes so good. Do you guys want some? That's right. You guys aren't really here.
Space Eye asks, what camera are you using? It looks great. Thank you. Well, the camera I'm using now is a Canon EOS Rebel T3i. I know that is a mouthful. Yeah, it's a great camera. And it even has a swivel screen, so that way I can turn it around and see where I am on the camera. The one bad thing about this camera, though, is that out of nowhere, it will stop recording and it will tell me, moving recording has been stopped automatically. And I'm like, why did you stop? It doesn't give me a reason why it just stops. It just stops. And it's just like, you don't need to say anything else. That is your time. Cut. So me and my camera going to need to have a talk because this shit is not cute. Insomniac Kid 7 asks, what is the weirdest thing that has happened to you? Okay, so one day, me and my friends was taking a walk at night to go to Jack in the Box. We was hungry. We was passing by the street, and the street has no sidewalks. So we see this guy, a dark figure, moving in a very strange manner. It is dark. He is dark. We don't know what's going on. So naturally, we start getting scared. And I was like, oh snap, I did not bring my knife. Because usually I bring a knife with me. But that day I had left it at home because I thought we was going to be fine. But that was only in Vegas because I don't feel safe in Vegas. No. So we start looking around for glass bottles. This man, hobo or whatever, he is literally kicking up in the air and doing karate kicks almost in the middle of the street. Just, mama, I'm gonna kick your butt. Mama, mama, mama. He was talking to himself in the middle of the road. We were scared as hell. We thought he was gonna come attack us and we just kept on walking past him. We was trying not to make a scene. That was definitely one of the weirdest nights of my life. Alright, and that's it for Q&A with Miles J number 8. Talk to you guys all later. Bye. Also, before I go, make sure you check the older Q&As before you guys ask a question. Because you never know, I might have answered your question before. Just putting that out there. Subscribe!